to weatherlink.com's bulletin page. The bulletin shows real-time, current data from each of your sensors based on the service plan you picked. The bulletin uses tiles to display different types of sensor data. Currently, we have temperature, humidity, wind speed, soil moisture profile probe, and soil moisture data displayed on the bulletin. These are all from the Davis Patio Gateway. Each gateway has its own bulletin page, which you can access from the drop-down to see your gateways and gateways that have been shared with you. If you look a little closer at the tile, you'll notice all of the information necessary to identify where the data is coming from. Temperature, humidity, and wind speed are from the weather station, which is italicized under the name of the tile. Also, both soil moisture tiles are from a node, which is listed in light gray at the bottom left of the tile. As you roll over items in a tile, it displays additional relevant data in a small box. All of the tiles are from the gateway Davis Patio, which is listed at the top of the viewing area. On the sidebar, I can see all of my nodes and sensors. These drop down to reveal the available tiles for a specific sensor. Let's access the weather station and add tiles for solar radiation, local forecast, moon phase, and barometer, and drop down the patio hose node and select the temperature probe. Then click update to add the tiles to the bulletin display area. You'll notice numbers in a box to the left of the sensor. That is the node port the sensor is plugged into. If the boxes are red, like in the node pressure test, that means we are having issues getting data from the sensor. You should check on the installation. Some other things that you can do with the tiles, you can hover over them and click the X to delete a tile. Move them by clicking the top of the tile and dragging them in the grid or expand the size of the tile by clicking the bottom right corner and dragging to the desired size. In some cases, like local forecast, expanding and minimizing the tile displays more or less information. Lastly, at the top of the screen in the display edit bar, you can click the summary icon to get all of the current sensor data in a table format, which can also be printed using the print icon in the display edit bar. That is a summary of the weatherlink.com bulletin display type.